So I know I know you said your dad was like in a rock band before and shit. So like, like you have like a crazy story from when you was young. Like like when you was young, he was still in the band and stuff. Uh yeah. Because I, I know there was like more in the band like in the eighties. Yeah, he was in a couple of different bands. He was in Uranium Two Thirty Five. Uh, then Law and Order, and then there was another one that I don't know the name of. Off the top of my head. Yeah. But yeah, he took me to a studio a couple of times. I've watched him record. He has his own drum set at the crib. Right. So yeah, he uh he got a, a record deal with uh Def Jam and was making beats with them uh, back in the day, like late eighties, nineties. Right, that's crazy. So what uh, like like you feel like like you was more into rock or how did you steer away from rock into rap? Like you feel me since your dad was a rock star or whatever. I mean more or less, like, because when I was growing up, like, my mom would put on whatever was on the radio. My father would always play, like, uh, Led Zeppelin, Guns N' Roses, same type word, of shit, word. shit like that. But more or less, as I got older, I just started, like, branching off and listening to shit on my own. But, Facts. Yeah, it was just crazy because at the same time, like, as, like, I was growing up, my dad still had all the memorabilia from when he was in Law & Order. And with having that, he, there was a whole lawsuit with the actual company like company TV show yeah. or in order and they went back and forth obviously a TV show has more money than facts than... they got them lawyers <laughs> mm-hmm. so what, what so you, would you say like rap was always a part of your life not necessarily rap but it was music it was in general facts facts so what what was your school life like <sighs> like in elementary school, always getting... Where you, like, where you went to in Staten Island? No, 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 no cause you say you... Yeah, in Jersey. You're seven, facts. Uh, I went to elementary school down in Dunellen, and then uh, after elementary school, like, that was just, like, rocky on its own, always getting suspended for fighting. In fifth grade, like, literally in fifth grade, got caught with a bunch of vapes. Oh, shit. Sure. <laughs> so, like, that was when that was first, like, started coming out, like, the little blue e-cigarettes. <laughs> yeah, them shits. <laughs> so, what was your high school life like? Never actually went to public high school because, like, one, I got locked up when I was uh, in eighth grade. I'm not going to get into details about what that was over, but that was a whole bunch of shit. A bunch of cases got dropped. Then uh, after that, they sent me to out-of-district school. I was on a house arrest bracelet for, like, a good year. So I was just like... Oh, so that was, like, letting you go to school, but you had to be home at a certain yeah. time, whatever. Yeah. Like, they would bust me in. Bust me up. Word. 